just want to welcome everyone to Seattle. So we've had, uh, uh, this is our 12th year that we've been doing this, and it's, one of, it's actually my favorite time of the year because usually it's sunny in Seattle, except for last night, it rained a little bit. Um, and uh, I get to see a lot of my old friends and colleagues, and it's incredible to me that we've been doing this for 12 years. Time flies. So um, I know everyone kind of checked in in the front, um, and uh, uh, we have an amazing staff. So you'll see uh, some of the staff, like Gary, Gary Hawley in the back there. So Gary's the director of the lab. So if you need anything, reach out to him. And then Linda and Alexis and Corey, um, we have a small staff here, but they're extremely friendly, capable, and uh, willing to help. So um, obviously, I want to thank all of our amazing faculty that have come. Uh, we have an incredible roster, both virtual and um, live here at SSF. We're kind of doing a hybrid this year just because of COVID, Delta variant, um, summer. Um, so it's kind of cool. And this is the agenda for Friday. So it's going to be a mixture of demos. And Dr. Chapman is going to be the first demo, and the first speaker is going to be Dr. Hardo. But today is going to be a, a mixture of demos, talks, and then tomorrow is going to be some talks, and then we're going to go into the lab, which I think is one of the best parts of the course. Um, I also want to thank our sponsors, because we can't do this without industry support. So our platinum sponsors this year are C-Spine and Nuvasive. Our gold sponsors are Alphatech, Depu Synthes, and Globus, um, uh, and Medtronic and, and Stryker. Our bronze sponsors are Serapedix and Vision. And then, um, again, we have 22 amazing faculty members from all the major institutions um, who are uh, part of this course. And then, um, uh, you know, uh, all the lectures, the demos are all going to be recorded. They'll be on YouTube. Um, they'll be on um, different social platforms. We do a lot of stuff on Instagram and as well as Facebook. And then I kind of wanted to do a quick um, overview of SSF. So, um, Lee, if we can switch over to the computer and Ben. Um, and, you know, we, we started SSF back in 2006, and we kind of didn't really know what we were going to do, but we were interested in doing education, and we wanted to use technology, you know, being in the um, backyard of Microsoft, Amazon, and uh, we had fellows, and, and so since then, um, you know, we've, we've basically used social media and, and the internet to really reach our audience, and it's incredible. We actually did some, um, one of our fellows, Perry, is writing a paper, and to, to date, we've reached over 121 million people worldwide. Um, and again, it's, you know, it's basically, today you'll see this, but we have an a amazing lab. Um, we do, we also have a research um, division here at SSF. We publish a lot. Um, we're really into, you know, uh, spreading the knowledge um, and using our global network to do this. And um, it's pretty incredible. Uh, you know, we've reached basically every country. Um, we've, we have uh, thousands of subs subscribers and uh, we have you know, tons of courses here every year, both industry, CME, residents, fellows, um, you know, all different disciplines. And again, um, I don't know if much of what you guys know about the internet, um, but it, it kind of started all in, in Seattle. Um, and it started a long time ago. And this is the Global Lambda Network. Um, and again, we, we partner with all institutions and um, we work with everyone. We sort of feel like we're the Switzerland of education. Um, and this is incredible, but you know, with technology, you can do a lot of cool stuff. So um, you know, we use all the different social media platforms. And um, this is just a, a brief kind of visualization of all the different things that go on during the course. We do demos. We've got our, um, we have a cadaver lab. Um, and uh, uh, um, you can see here, just during the daytime, just how much stuff actually goes on. And this is just one 
video that got like two million views in a short amount of time. So you can see people are extremely um, thirsty for knowledge and learning and, and you know, I think um, uh, between the faculty and all the great courses that we have, we've been able to really produce some excellent content. Um, and uh, one last thing before we introduce Dr. Hartle. So um, we have a very special birthday today. So Dr. Chapman um, is uh, an August 6th uh, birthday boy. And then, um, and Charlie, uh, if you don't mind coming up here. So Charlie is a, uh, is a dear friend. We're residents together in Virginia, and we've been doing this course for 12 years together. And, um, and uh, we added Dr. Chapman about seven years ago. We stole him from the University of Washington. And I remember when I was a resident, Jens Chapman came and was visiting professor at UVA. Um, and uh, he tried to pit me on a question. Uh, and it was, I don't know if you remember this, Jens, but it was like a 12-year-old who had a little bit of a antrolis thesis that had been transferred from Alaska. And he was trying to get me to operate on the, on the patient. And I was like, no, this is not surgical. And both Charlie and I um, were chief residents, and Jens was a visiting professor. And, and I remember talking to him, and, and we formed a great friendship even when I was in Seattle. You know, um, and both of us, you know, we grew up in you know, the whole AO, North America, and spine education. And, and Jens was always someone that I look up to and still look up to. He's one of the leaders, um, and if not, probably the most famous orthopedic spine surgeon in the world. And he's taught me a lot. And I, um, the last seven years, Jens has been great. And uh, I really appreciate all the, all the stuff that you've done, both for SSF, Swedish, the fellowship. Um, and uh, we really want to wish you a happy birthday. So we got him an Italian cream cake pie. And um, we did put his age on there. So happy birthday, Jens. Um, so, so just a quick, um, and and then I'm gonna I'm gonna shut up and let Charlie uh, talk here. But Jens, it's really been an, an honor, privilege, and uh, we I just love working with you. Not many of you know this, but uh, Dr. Chapman is very musically um, uh, talented. He used to gifted. He, um, he used to actually play in a band. I have some old pictures of him with really long hair. Um, and uh, he actually is a very gifted um, uh, singer as well. Yeah, thanks, thanks Rod, and, and happy birthday, Jens. It's, uh, it's definitely an honor to, to be here and to uh, celebrate uh, this, this, uh, this event. You know, it's, it's one of those, uh, last year this was a totally virtual event and it's nice to see that now we're getting back to, to uh, a hybrid event and hopefully next year a completely in-person event. And uh, uh, this is the 12th year that this course has been held and uh, it really is unparalleled as far as uh, bringing together uh, excellent faculty and uh, outstanding fellows and residents uh, who uh, have the opportunity to work with one another. And this is a combination. This, this, what you see right there in front of you is the collaboration between neurosurgery and orthopedic surgery. And that's the whole point of one spine. You know, it's, it's one spine, so <clears throat> both specialties contribute to it. Uh, and uh, and it's uh, I think it's a testament. Uh, this course has been a testament to uh, the future uh, of, of spine surgery, and, and uh, every year it gets better and better.